All right, so how do you build a funnel agency from zero to 30,000 per month? That's what I'm gonna do on this channel. It'll probably be like a three part series, but I'm gonna start with the foundations of me picking a niche, choosing a pricing and going after this specific type of group. And I'll show you where I get these clients. And then I'll show you the content creation that goes into attracting those clients, as well as the outbound, the outreach method that I use, which is funnel audits or loom videos where we sort of give them a couple of tips, we get them to request us to build their funnel or improve the current one. Besides that, we're not only gonna build the funnels for clients, I am going to build a team that builds the funnels. I'm gonna be the CEO that builds the strategy that outlines the funnel, and then I'm gonna hire people, which is probably the, the most exciting part of this challenge is not only getting to 30K, because I've had 30K a you know, month in, in, in my business, but as a funnel builder, a solo freelancer funnel designer, I've had 20K months without any team members. The only issue was that I, I was kind of burning out. So. The reason why we're doing this is I'm gonna show you the foundations for scaling above 20K per month with a funnel agency with just one niche using SOPs and um, building a team and system. So let's dive in. This is a post that I made yesterday. Who wants to see me build a funnel agency 30K per month with just one niche, team, SOPs and everything. 200 people liked it, 150 people commented. I even got someone down here who's uh, interested already. So let's see if I get my first client. There we go. So hopefully I can build a funnel for Cody. He asked me, what funnels do you do? And I said, this is pretty much my elevator pitch. I build automated course funds to pay course creators 24 seven. He asked how much, and then I go into my DM closing scripts. And, and now another part of this challenge, which is so much different than anything I've done is, not only am I building a team, which, you know, I have to remove my ego and say, look, we're gonna help a lot of people get to 30K per month. I need a team. I, I don't want to do this myself. I don't want to burn out. I have a family. I have a life outside of this. I have an education company. The other part with that is I'm just going to start booking calls. And if you know me, I've you know closed 90% plus of all my clients. I've made six figures just from DMs, messaging people just like Cody here. What funnels do you do? I ask them a couple of questions. I give them a good deal. And it's like 2.5K here, 3.5K here, 4,000 here, just from DMs. So yeah, this is different, but if I just do calls and outsource everything else, I can share that process here. So that's kind of the, the strategy here. So I have to sacrifice my introvertism and become an extrovert, reinvent myself. But with that, let's dive in. First things first that we're going to fill out is this funnel agency pillars tool that we have inside of FFD, online businesses, and more specifically, the sub niche is course creators. Funnel type is sales page to order form, to potential one-time offers or upsells, and then thank you page. Okay, so that's the funnel type. It's a course funnel, but those are the steps. And then the outcome is, well, you could sell passive income through courses. So we're gonna sell funnels to those people. We're gonna build it so that they can just focus on helping people by making better courses. Because that's well needed in the industry. Well, obviously my new funnel agency is automated course funnels. I even have my own simple <laughs> portfolio. Uh, we build automated course funnels that bring in daily sales, got some uh, PR credibility, and then I have like how it works. Step one. This is pretty good because a lot of people have questions on like what's included. And so it's good to have it outlined like here, here's the steps. Here's kind of how we work. And then our most recent projects, I could just take this one for an example, save the image, go into Facebook, make a post saying course creators, your funnel not converting. And I could make a post about that. Obviously, you know, a little bit more context and, and copy there. But then the next thing I would do is just go to course creator communities, groups. You can see I'm, I'm a part of these already. That's 50,000 people. I could join this one, that's 67,000. And now we're already at 100,000 people. Boom, you join this one, awesome. And now I could start connecting with people who are course creators. I feel like this person is a course creator, so I could go to their main profile. I can see is their group, Tribe Academy, Client Attraction Summit. First, what I'll do is I will add a friend and I am going to give feedback on this. People are waiting for you. I feel like we could have a stronger sales hook, like the, the headline there. But anyways, so I could give feedback on this. Same thing here. If I have advice on, yeah, 
like design along with the copy here. I already see two things we could do to make this better. For example, FAQ down here, offer stack. Anyways, so I would just record a video just like this, click Loom and I choose screen only and then current tab and I record this and I record a video and send it to Sharla. And I say, hey, I love your offer, what you have going on with Tribe Academy. I build funnels for people like you. I would love to see how I can help you with your funnel. Here's an example of a similar one that I've built. And then I show an example of a funnel that I've built. And by the way, if you don't have funnels, you just build like a concept funnel. That way I can provide value while outreaching to people and I can get 20 people per day or 10 people per day. Combine that with content that I produce. You can see I have 4.9K friends. So, you know, when I make a post, you can see 200 people. So that is the strategy. We got the foundations, we got the outreach and inbound strategy. We're just using a simple social media profile. And so people see that we're all about funnels. And now let's dive into the most fun part. So this is really where we're putting together a team of people. So like, what's the first step in our funnel agency, the process, you have to kind of look at it from like a roadmap journey, like a, a journey perspective and say, okay, what are the steps, the stages? First, the big stages that our clients has to go through. And then you ask yourself like, who's doing what? So here, for example, prospecting, that's going to be, I'll just put a card here so we have some notes. That's not how I would uh, build out my system, but it would more be, be like this, like client one, client two. And so here, the next one, which is sales, as we book a call, I would just move them here. And then when we close a deal, I would just move them here. And within these, we can have description like here's info on client one. Okay. Recording from zoom call and then i have a link there and then i can just add people in here by add to cart and i add members in there the next step is really where you're the ceo and you plan out the funnel structure and the strategy so this could be strategy and then the next thing is after you have that you have all the info from the client you can do like a loom video for your team the next part is copywriting and then from there we have design so the designer has copy to write from and then just align the copy with the design that's all you know a mistake that i see a lot of people make both as funnel builders but also as ceos who hire funnel builders and funnel designers they say hey look the, the copyright is working on the copy you can just start designing and the designer is like okay like you kind of want me to just put something in there and it doesn't make sense and and some ceos even have the audacity to review it and give feedback to the designer like this is not what we're looking for or this is uh the you know the design doesn't make sense like no shit like we don't have any copy and that's why i write the copy and i and then do the design but if you're a designer wait for the copy so you know what you're going to design if you talk about the offer you're going to design some mock-ups or some graphics that communicate what the offer is. Next step we have is the review. So this is quality control and this is going to be by me. So once the copyright and designer has done their, their work, the client one goes to onboarding. I do like the overview strategy of the funnel. Copywriter gets to work with the information we have from the onboarding. Designer builds out the first draft. I will review it. What I'm also going to do because I kind of know how to build funnels after building 400 of them. I can go in and make it go from a 8.5 out of 10 to a 9.5 out of 10. Then we send it over to review by client. From there, boom, they give you know feedback. By the way, if they have a lot of feedback or edits, you just move it back to the, the right person. And then again, it goes back to the review. And then from here, we do like tech integrations. And then finally, we approve it or launch it. So we'll just call it done. And then from there, you can obviously ask for testimonials, all that to leverage them to maybe get more clients or get more referrals from them. That's sort of the backend systems, everything that I teach in FFD. The best part about this challenge though, I sent out an email yesterday about this. There's a lot of stuff that's gonna happen. And yes, we share kind of strategies and content strategies and how to get leads and close clients and everything on here, but in FFD and this, but I don't want this to be like a huge pitch, but I can't share some of the stuff publicly. Like I have DM closing recordings of me talking to clients and what I'm saying to them and what they're telling me. And especially if you already have some of them, 
you know, it's going to be cheaper and I can give a, a good package deal. But if you want to start with one and see my work, that's also sort of... I can't share that publicly, but in a small community, in a private group like FFD, I'm able to do this. So if you want to learn how we do that, if you want to learn how to maybe hire people for your business, who can build funnels and you want to have the, the team and the systems to do so, they're in FFD. If you want to have the funnel design skills or the copywriting skills, we have those modules. We have uh, Sketch, Canva, we have Figma, we have funnel templates, 60 different funnel templates for you. Everything inside of FFD. So yes, it's turning into a pitch, but I'm proud of it. And the, the feedback that we've had recently is so amazing. So that's why I'm like, look, I'm just gonna become an extrovert and I'm gonna talk to more people, help more people. And that way, hopefully, as I build this business, I can share it, document it, and it'll help more people. So with that said, I will see you in the next video. And if you haven't already, make sure you like, subscribe, all the good stuff and I'm out. I'm actually having a meeting right now with a potential client. So I'll see you in the next one. Peace.